So thanks a lot for watching this video. I promise you it's very important and it's very applicable to the times we're living in right now. Due to the COVID-19 coronavirus pandemic, there has been an unprecedented amount of breaches, security, and technology problems that we've observed. There are a few very important primary things that you as a business owner need to make sure you have control of. And in this video, I'm gonna go over those things. Okay, so first thing, Google My Business. Google My Business is a specific profile page, which means it has your address information, your business, your website link, your directions, and all of that. It also includes images and reviews and everything about your business that Google can understand as well as potential new public to your practice or business. Every single one of our dental clients, veterinarian clients, and optometrist clients have one of these pages. And whether you're a client or not, this applies to you because it's that important. So the first thing we wanna make sure of on your Google My Business page is that you, the owner, are listed as a primary owner on that account. If you're not the owner, you wanna immediately address this and you wanna keep a close record of anyone who does have access to the account and what level of privilege they have and why they have access to the account. So you can keep this in a simple little spreadsheet or a note, a document, whatever it is, but you wanna keep tabs on this. Of course, as well as the username and password associated with the account, kept in a very secure place, but a locatable place. And last on this, you never assign owner, you know, you never assign anything unless you absolutely know what you're doing. And at the end of this video, I'm gonna give, you know, we're doing a complimentary point on this to help you resolve this if it's a problem or you have questions. So notice that on the Google My Business page settings, as you can see here, yes, that's me listed there, but you see a manager and a primary owner on the account. That's what you wanna see. You wanna see your name as the primary owner on your business. Now keep in mind, there are other levels and access privilege levels, even owner, which is a little confusing for some people, but there are also managers that are associated with the Google My Business page. Again, you wanna make sure you know everyone who has access, why they have access, what they're doing with it, and if they don't need access or you're not sure, again, I'm gonna cover that at the end of this video. Second primary and most important thing is your Facebook business page. Again, every single one of our dental, veterinary, and optometry clients has one of these. This is, again, an extremely important important public relations and communications area for your business for promotion, advertising, and general public level display. And again, it's extremely important that you are the primary owner of this page as well. And again, same points apply. Make sure anyone who does have access, you know who they are, you know why they have access, you know what they're doing with it, and if not, you get rid of it. And if you don't know, again, at the end of this video, we have a solution for you on that. And that those Google, or, excuse me, Facebook page looks like this. So there's page owners, there's agencies, there's various page roles such as admin and editor. So Facebook has a lot of different levels of access, all of which you should be aware of. And again, tabulated, noted, who has access, why, and if they don't, let's resolve it. Now I didn't include it in this specific slide series here, but your website, and access to that is equally important. Again, all of our clients, whether a dentist, optometrist, veterinarian, all of them have a website. And yes, making sure that's secure is equally important because a lot of things can happen that you're unaware of if that is not being monitored and closely watched. So you just wanna know who has access to your website, what they do with it, and keep in mind, website is a very unique technology because there's multiple ways that access can be gained. And it's not often understood that a website is separate from the domain name itself. So if, you're, if, you're, if you access your website by going to bestdentistintown.com, the bestdentistintown.com is a unique thing that is separate from the actual website itself. They're two separate things. So you wanna make sure that you have secure, same way, these, all these points apply, the same thing with the domain name that I just went over and the website files and information itself should be all protected in a very simple, clean way that you know who's doing what and why, and again, removing privileges if not needed. 
as you can see here, we are offering a complimentary security audit to our clients, of course, which we already monitor. But if you're not an existing client, we are offering this and extending that out to our friends and anyone that we've had contact with in the last year. So if you receive this email, this applies to you and feel free to take up this offer. All you have to do is text free sec audit to 503-482-9321 and we will correspond with you and coordinate a call to gather some information from you to help and assist you document this and find out where you're at in terms of your ownership and what you need to do to resolve that if it's a problem, if you're currently in a bad situation with it. So thank you for watching. Uh, we wish you all well. We hope your uh, family, your staff, your friends are all safe and um, uh, healthy and doing well in terms uh, in this pandemic that we're still still going up and down through. So thank you very much for watching and uh, talk to you soon.